In the following video, we will cover changing theme elements. It doesn't require an extensive amount of CSS and HTML code knowledge. However, it is important to back up your theme files before you begin. Making changes to your theme once it is done is not reversible. However, there are many options to make sure that your theme is backed up. You can either clone the theme to keep the remaining live theme intact and work on a separate version that is identical, or you can export the files and save them just in case. you will be making changes in the global CSS editor. Any changes that you will see while inspecting the element can be changed here. To begin, right click, hit inspect element, and select the magnifying glass. You will then choose the item that you wish to see the information on. As right now, we can see that the background color of our menu bar is right here, and you can change the color whichever color you choose and you can see the preview of what color it's going to look like, as well as the hex code number. You can refresh the page to get it back to its original state, inspect the element, and you can copy the hex code. So when you right click and save, copy the hex code, you will then go back to your AmeriCommerce admin console, go to themes, Click Edit Theme, Global CSS Editor, and hit Control F with your keyboard to find the hex code, and hit Paste. All of these hex codes are the colors that you need to change. In this instance, we're changing it to white, which is the hex code for six Fs. and hit save. Now we will preview it. And as you can see, we have just now changed our menu to be white as well as the sidebars. You can also look at various other items on the page such as font, which in the right you can change. You can right click, find the font, type in the font that you want, and you can see it previewed on the page. You can also change the size and other things to it. However, this will not show on the server, this is just a preview. And that is how you inspect an element using the Google Developer Tools.